these all the time. What about uh, Disaster versus Ill Immaculate? We can do that one for Let's sure. I haven't that. seen that battle in forever. Yeah, I'm always, yeah, I've been wanting to watch that battle forever, but I can't because Ill Mac's always on the show. Yeah, and <laughs> Ill Mac did um, two battles that day. He battled Madness as well, right? Yep. Yeah. Battle yep. of the Bay 2? Yeah, uh, yeah, no, 3. 3, yeah. yeah. Alright, cool. This one's a short one, Have too. Have you guys ever watched Fresco vs. Illusion Z? Of course. Yeah, no, we haven't watched it on oh, here. Oh, on here. Yeah, that one's Ooh, fire, too. Yeah. One. We can watch that. At, yeah. All right, where's Ill Mac? Selena's bitch getting shot in the face. Oh man, I love that uh, dirt nasty line in the body mood too. Movie. Oh yeah. Where shows up on camera. He's like, all right, let's shoot this bitch. No Selena. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Word. All right, guys, we're gonna watch a grind time classic, disaster versus Ill Immaculate. A lot of people suggested us to watch it. It's only fitting that we watch it with Yannick in the room. Um, because he was heavily around at this era, and we could laugh at a lot of the same things, like World Star being on the fucking video. Yeah, <laughs> that is the World Star hip hop. You know what's crazy, man? Like, World Star was not big back then. No, you know no. what I mean? Like, they're small. They, yeah, we were yeah. kind of like peaking around the same time. But I remember, like, they were. You know, I had a good relationship with Q. I used to always like, you know, feed content, and they would do the same. And we had that thing. Hey, look, you just put our name up in it, and I'll post all your battles. Like, yeah. You go on World Star, it's so funny. You can find OZ versus Jack shit. You can find mm -hmm. me versus Sage. Like any old King of the ba Dot battles are on World Star for yeah. that relationship that we all built with them. They really help spike Battle Rap's popularity. Yeah, for sure. Just the Q, man. He was one of the first people to put Battle Rap on. That's dope. Um, yeah, so this is from Battle of the Bay 3 <clears throat> Disaster versus Ilmac. Ilmac's second battle of the day. And this also was Ilmaculate's uh, first time doing this form of battle rap which was written mm -hmm. battles and that shows you how fucking new all this was like this is already battle bay three yeah. this is the first time Ilmax even doing like a written battle mm -hmm. you know um shout out to lush and plex rock man they're my favorite two hosts hell yeah and oh man there's so many good things about this so watching old grind time battles is like a time capsule of fashion for what what's, <laughs> oh my what's lush this wearing is where, um, <laughs> this is what everyone else wore a this year this is where later. sickle battled revenant too right Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. There was the foreign beef that started with. <laughs> Whatever happened to Revenon? Uh, he just became a, a manager of a Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> and, and, and really? Yeah, he does, yeah, yeah uh, he's just like working a normal job now. He was um, so into this stuff. I know, though, I know. How do you just be so into something and one day just be like, eh. I always wonder that too yeah. because like he was on the forums every day making all these like yeah. promo pieces and then yeah. he just stopped. He mm -hmm. was actually a good promoter, man. Like, he yeah, sold yeah. himself well. For real. You know, like, you gotta, now looking back, we used to look at it like, oh, this guy's fucking corny. He's out here promoting it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he did get a gun pulled on him in a battle and kept rapping. So that's pretty impressive. Did he? Yeah. Little, oh, uh, yeah. In the Florida. Yeah, in the Florida. The yeah. He's like, if any of you guys are gangsters, pull out a weapon pull out right now. Hey, yeah, there if go. any of you guys there are go. gangsters, pull out a weapon right now. And then this dude's holding a, a bag a with a, a gun. Yeah. And he's like, here we go. Here. And he's like dangling. It was so weird. And he's like, you got a gun? I think it was, like, um, it, was, it was dangling from something that he had tied to... Uh, his belt buckle yeah. so he could drop it in his pants and word, just pull word. Out okay. it okay. <laughs> but he kept rapping so that was yeah. cool yeah um, but yeah Disaster versus Ilmac this was Ilmac's second battle of the day Ilmac is a fucking nutcase he uh, in the first two battles he did or two events he battled that in grind time he battled fucking four people 
He battled yeah. Madness, Disaster, Hall of the Dawn, and Conceited. Those were his first four all of time you can battles. See, all of whom <laughs> you can see embodied. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And, and this back here, too, this was, like, the first, like, peak of Disaster. Because, like, you know, he did the WRCs, and we knew he was good, but when he battled Thesaurus, it was, like, He's amazing. Whoa. Yeah. He beat the Saurus. What yeah. the fuck? Like, yeah. the Saurus was all of our gods. And yep. then all of a sudden, disaster just comes to him, like, fuck all your yeah. plans. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. And who is this and, fool? And then it came to this event, which was, it made it super interesting to watch, right? Because we all knew Ilmac, which was also the Saurus's fucking partner. Yeah. Won Scribble Jam 2004. is like this battle vet, you know? Won the World Rap Championships twice. Yeah. And now he's going up against the guy that just beat his partner. So yeah. it was, like, super interesting. Coming back for, for revenge. All yeah, and that's almost like the way a lot of people kind of looked at it, right? Like back then. And now it's so weird because the time capsules and the time periods of all these battles and when they take place, they just get lost. They're just footage. But like, yep. you don't understand like the little stories that created certain matchups and created like the hype behind Yeah, the things, momentum, right? the trajectory yeah. of people, like especially like, you know, there's a lot of people like that. Like, you know, like Hollow, uh, Tay Rock, Diz is a big one too, yeah. Conceited. You know, they all have like this crazy trajectory that just like, if you know the history behind it, you can see why they escalated so big. Crazy. Um, and yeah, also D Diz battled two people in this battle too. He Locksmith. battled everybody knows oh, and uh, that was a great Bill Mac. Yeah. So was this before or after Locksmith? This is before. This? Okay. Imagine yeah. setting up an event these days and Impact promoting two. two people battling two people yeah. on a card. Like no. everyone would be like, "What?" The yeah, everybody would like, be like, "Why are you doing that?" And, and it's insane. Yeah, it would be horrible. They would yeah. hate on it. There would <laughs> the be like, no recent, love. It'd yeah. be reverse marketing. Yep. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. The most recent occasion of that I can think of, and I'm probably in terms of a big stage was. Um, was it Massacre where DNA was booked twice and he didn't come through against like uh, 40 bars and somebody else? Booked. Yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah, you're, you're right. right. Yeah, I totally one. forgot about that. Yeah. yeah hit, uh, Dirtbag Dan, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I had to postpone it. Yeah, mm -hmm. that, that was the most recent occasion I could think of a battler being advertised battle twice. Yeah. I totally forgot about that. And it used to that. be so normal back yeah, then. Yeah, it, it did. did. You yeah, know what's crazy. even crazier, dude? There was a battle that was supposed to happen in Don't Flop. Where Thesaurus was supposed to battle three times. That's insane. Oh, I remember that. He was supposed to battle yeah. Truth, Archaic, and I think Respect BA or something. Really? Three fucking times, dude. That's insane. QP. Uh, oh, QP. He did battle three he times. He battled three times, and Billy Boondocks did that, uh, like, last year. Oh, my God. He threw an event where he battled three people. <laughs> oh, hey, my you, God. You gotta respect Billy Boondocks' hustle, man. Shout like, out fucking... fucking grind, shout man. out Sharon and Body. Dude. Yeah, yeah, Jimmy Pistols. That's my yeah. favorite part. No, honestly. <laughs> That's my favorite I, fucking part. I feel like Sharon... Him and Pat, dude, they're the best yeah. part. I'm like, oh, my God. <laughs> Yo, Sharon is, like... He's gonna be such a fucking superstar, man. And yeah. I tell people, and it's like, not only is he super talented, but like you see when it comes to stuff like that, like he had to He's play a role man. Yeah. that was not him. You yeah. know, and it's so funny in body, they make Sharon dress the way we all wish he dressed. You <laughs> yeah. know what I mean? Back in the day. Yeah, he got his he got his hat like this, his yeah. big shirt, and he's like, yo, like, you know what I mean? <laughs> so it's so cool to be able to see him to adapt to that character, play it well, and then just walk with it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. I don't want to give too much away, but like he really does good in that man and, and I'm proud of that kid, man. Yeah, me too. He's killing it, man. Shout out Sharon. But yeah, let's get into Disaster versus Ilmat. Time it is. Battle of the Bay Part Trey, the main event. On my right hand side. Represent Portland, St. John's. Dude, my the be, my favorite part about that battle is Diz's little like uh you know his like inner uh between line rhymes. Yeah. Where like you drop your water bottle, he's like, he dropped his water bottle like a faggot. <laughs> and like keeps going. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I was so confident going into that battle, and then the second Diz started rapping, I was like, what am I doing here, man? Like, this is fucking <laughs> stupid. Take me back to Kitchener. Because, again, it's like the poor rich soul kind of effect. Like, Diz was so loud, and I remember just, like, the way he was rapping at me. He was, like, moving Stomping back and forth. Shit. But, like, eyes never left eye contact. Yeah. And he was like, this guy is fucking psycho. Yeah. Man. I mean, why am I here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Battle of Bay 5, dude, never will be replicated, no, man. That's that was such of a, all time. Yeah. Yep. Super yep. fun, man. Right hand side representing Portland, St. John's. Height question mark. Oh my God! Strengths murdering the game and crushing everything. everything. Those are some good MySpace.com yep. slash ill. MySpace. Oh, it's not even. They didn't even put the dot com because I think in MySpace you couldn't do that. Wasn't it like you couldn't look up like the actual URL? You had to like type in the name or something so. like that? I think so. I think you're right. I think Facebook right. was yeah. like that too when yeah. it first started. You couldn't actually, I think it might be even now too. Yeah, people didn't have their own URL, yep. personalized URL. Yep. Yep. Height, question mark. got my mark. man's he's immaculate. Yeah, he's hella serious in this. <laughs> Nothing less than a 
legend. Shout out to all Grind Time Divisions and King of the Dot and Don't Flop and everybody keeping the battle movement lit, for real. What up, Jump Off? One love, Jump Off. Represent Los Angeles, Cali. We got... Okay, this is the fucking amazing part. His strengths. <laughs> 6, 65,234 multis in your mum's ass in less than a minute. <laughs> this is the most disastrous thing ever. Yeah, exactly. That's like a Cap Cow's intro. It's like one of those things like, who writes these? Well, yeah. clearly the rappers. <laughs> <laughs> fucking incredible, dude. That should have been his strength for his uh, Smack debut, too. <laughs> keep Disaster. it going. Another motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah. Super serious, dude. So just to let y'all know, this battle, since we got a Grind Time Division president of the Northwest in the house, this is going to be a not judged battle. Three one minute rounds and a special 90 second fourth round. Woo! <laughs> Dude! Special 90 second Different round. Fucking times. Woo! 90 That's seconds. A round and a half. Yeah. <laughs> God, dude, that's insane how much shit has changed, man. Both these guys are crazy for doing two battles in a night, though. For man. real. I could never, Fucking bro. insane. Ilmac is fucking nuts for battling Conceited and Hollow the yeah. Dawn on the same fucking day, dude. Yeah. I don't give a fuck he what is, anybody says about him, like, losing both. He's like, dude, he battled two of the best, arguably, yeah. battle rappers of all fucking time in the same day, and he did... With conceded, it was unlimited rounds. Yeah, two. Did this yeah. battle two people at MLB as well, or was it just A class? Uh, it was uh, A class and Arsenal. Oh, MLB. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah, right. yeah. It was so A class yeah, and Arsenal. Did, yeah. That's crazy. Man. Yeah, that is. Nuts. <laughs> did that A class perform? Yeah, I'll go first. You want to oh. go first? Oh, okay. yeah. We're gonna switch after the third round. Having the pace. <laughs> and even like semi recently, like. Disaster, and then him versus Dumb. Like, <laughs> yeah. he's down to battle twice on the same weekend now, yeah. I guess. Yeah. Uh, very now, little has changed. Yeah, that Disaster thing was actually, like, crazy how they did that. Man. I think it, it was fucking amazing, dude. Yeah. That shit was so fun. That whole weekend, I, like, I love that Diz. I love the yeah. Diz that's, like, having fun with shit, like, being crazy, because he's a very theatrical person. He's a very, like, big personality, yeah. and I like when he, like, puts it towards something that's not only, like, theatrical for the audience but also fun like I, I i don't like how sometimes we take the shit so serious that it turns into this volatile toxic yeah. violent thing when it's like diz was fucking hilarious as disaster and then dressing up as a monk versus yeah dumb no matter that being pretty you, you know, know whatever but that's so funny because i remember we were in the the hotel with the sandman and we had rooms on both sides i don't know if you guys remember how the conference yeah. rooms were at the top so I remember being up there with a bunch of people, and you'd look out one window, and Dumb Founder was like behind a dumpster going over his stuff, and he's like really like to himself, just yeah. spinning in circles. And then you look out the front, and you got Diz practicing a spin kick. <laughs> 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 and everyone was so like, what's yes. he doing? You know? And then all of a sudden, the battle happened. He's like, back up! Yeah. And he, and he does a spin kick. It's like, boom. It yeah. all came to life. Yeah, you know yeah, yeah. I mean? <laughs> Fucking amazing, dude. Yo, measly. <clears throat> Hey yo, hold it down. Hey yo, this faggot is shameless. You really have to explain this. First you battled the source, got mad he was racist, turned around and specifically asked Lush to battle an Asian. <laughs> you fucking hypocrite. Look, you ain't even close to me, so dead it. Why battle me in New York? You can't even hold a decent record. See, he knew I beat him in Cali, seeing as how he ain't even locally respected. Homie, you're a nobody. You know that he's pathetic. How's he supposed to be the best? I wouldn't know that he's a threat if writings weren't so openly accepted. <laughs> Fuck it. You are such a bitch. You will only be content when your clothing is expensive. You're probably controlling and obsessive and need to go home and clean your ovary infection. Look, he's sweeter than potpourri, acting all overly aggressive. But the only thing we see is a little hoe that needs attention. Crazy in the grind time era to be rapping this good. Yeah. yeah that's so, like, almost weird to it's hear. It's almost like... It's it's almost I don't even know how to explain it because it seems up to date. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, totally. Yeah, I know. I was listening to it like this sounds like recent, you know. Yeah. Not like um, obviously some of the schemes and the you know the the level of like uh, multi that he's choosing and shit is kind of aged. But to be able to rap this good, then it was more kind of like bar 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 reaction, you know. But even today, like you know, overly aggressive, openly accepted. Yeah, that's most dope. battlers today can't 
multi that much. You're right. And make right. it seem normal. Yep. You're 100% right. He's sweeter than potpourri, acting all overly aggressive. But the only thing we see is a little hoe that needs attention. Oh! Never do. I bet that you're a criminal, but make sure my name ain't never set up in your interview. So what if I hate you? Be thankful for all the attention this is getting you. Hold it down. Alright, y'all. This is about to be some madness. Get it? Cause he got his ass red by madness. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking amazing. That's uh, in reference to uh, uh, satire and dumbfounded versus Jay's juice and waps. When satire is battling Jay's, and he's like, uh, "It's about to be awkward. Get it? Because he got served by awkward's." It's like the exact. <laughs> Yo, earlier I saw you battling, and all you seem to do is you babbling. You're the only dude here up there that needed three chairs high just to see who the fuck was battling. <laughs> hey, you say I'm all rins? Or you're a queer with your fucking rap. To prove I rins, I'll tell you, at least I can fit my ears in my hat. Hey yo, hey yo. <laughs> I fucking love that. <laughs> the just to prove I'm freestyling yeah. bars are always the best. In my hat. Yeah. <laughs> fucking love it. Yeah, he's prove such I a good freestyler though, man. Like that <laughs> yeah. shit is not easy yeah, to do. All, well, all that shit was win. freestyle. Yeah. You know what I mean? And like have it's not like he's just doing like single syllable rhymes either, man. Like he's mm -hmm. freestanding and using multis and they're making yeah. sense. Like yep. to yep. be able to just not pull nonsensical bullshit yeah. and like even though it's like okay, it's not a diss, he just pointed out ears are in his hat, but yeah. it's like clear that I got or clear the rap, ears and like Yeah. It's it's a, it's it's not easy to do that. This man. battle also exemplifies what's the best about disaster. It also was in this the source battle that when he gains that momentum and the crowd starts getting behind him, and Ilmac actually is the one that brought this up to me first. He becomes this like fucking like big thing yeah. where he's just like he gets bigger than life. You can also see it in his DNA battle, but like as the crowd's fucking with him more, he just gets like more and more like animated, and that just contributes more to his performance. And like right here where he's freestyling, people are getting more on board. You can see him like leveling up. Rich! I'll tell you, at least I can fit my ears in my hat. Hey yo, hey yo, 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 I can see mad clear. I'm about to smoke this punk. You act queer, then I'll choke you up. You whack queer, you won the championships last year, but you're back here and you look broke as fuck. Oh. Hey yo, hey yo, hey yo, what happened? Doesn't Harry have you on allowance steady? Jesus Christ, Immaculate Bounty buy a new outfit already. Hey yo, hey yo, disaster, I'm gonna use this new style as a weapon. Hey yo, I bet the source grew some muscles on his shoulders from having to carry your faggot ass all through 2007. Whoa. Hey yo, so how the fuck are you gonna wreck yourself as a man knowing that he carried you like Jesus and then all you saw was two steps in the sand? That was great. Yeah. <laughs> I know, it's, but you know what's really nuts is that Diz's round felt really short because he like kind of like, w like wasted more time in between, you mm -hmm. know? Or uh, Ilmac kind of just wrapped through his shit. Yeah. And to me, Ilmac's round didn't really feel that. It felt short, but it wasn't like, wow, that was like really short, you know? Diz really tried to prove like the freestyle, like the fact that Ilmac called him out, like, oh, the written, he, he spent like the first like 25 seconds trying yeah, to like, like yep. rebuttal that yep. type of thing. You know? Ilmac is smart, man. Yeah, yeah. he is. He's super he knows how to smart. break people down yeah. and like, that's a, he'll psychoanalyze you. Yep. You know what I mean? And be like, okay, look, I'm gonna do this, and this is gonna be what gets under his skin. You yep. know, and then they, he'll take like, you off your game. Like with that. him and Pat, where he's like, he's like, watch him. He'll he'll lick his lips all the time, and you could tell in the battle, Pat was like conscious, mm -hmm. like, yeah, I'm, 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 gonna do it. <laughs> I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> hey yo, how do we come to this madness, yo? It's funny you cracking jokes, but spit something that's factual. Like how you on my phone, riding my dick like a month and a half ago. Oh. Yo, let's be honest, you ain't brolic, this dude's fake. I've been to his crib, he's softer than chewed grapes. So I promise, I am not gonna lose. Now to this fruitcake, this kid's an embarrassment. He lives with his parents and calls them his roommates. Oh. Dog. Dog, if you're the secret. If you're the sickest, then the art's dead. I'll clip him like a jarhead. He thinks he's swimming up in large bread because he put spinners on his car bed. <laughs> you fucking mama's boy. You haven't proven your usefulness to mankind. Dude is... Shit, that line is crazy for a setup. You haven't proved, proved your, your usefulness, usefulness for mankind. mankind. Jesus. <laughs> you fucking mama's boy. You haven't proven your usefulness to mankind. Dude is getting mad hype, but you sound stupid and you cram rhymes. Only thing natural about disaster is losing by a landslide. Oh. <laughs> 
his maximum swagger. He thought that we'd be impressed, but this unnatural disaster is a small inconvenience at best. Damn, dude. Such a good performer, man. He yeah. sounds so clean when he raps. There's no, like, stuttering. And even when Ilmac does stutter, he finds a way to kind of, like, not make it, like, a big deal. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know, for real. kind of push through it, but Jake yep. is really good. Yeah, it's all like the clarity of it is super yeah. clear and yeah. it cuts through, like cuts really hard through the audience. Yeah, I, I think, yo, I think it's great how you uh, said that I live with my dad at home, but I suggest you get off the source's nutsack and get some raps of your own. Yo, oh. hey yo, I'm a fist fighting instigator. <laughs> 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 yes! Yes! <laughs> Fucking amazing, man. Zero, yeah, that's 60. my favorite day, yeah. though, when he's angry like that, because, oh, yeah. like I said, I was on the receiving end of it, so when you're like, it's, an, yeah. it, I don't know, I think that's the best version of him. Dude, yeah. Like the best version of him is when it's not at you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> this is what it fucking feels like. <laughs> but yeah, zero to 60, real fucking yeah. quick right there. That's it's great amazing. how you, uh, said that I live with my dad at home, but I suggest you get off the source's nutsack and get some raps of your own. Yo, oh. hey yo, I'm a fist fighting instigator. This is the result of growing up with no fucking milk in your refrigerator. Hey yo, yo check it out, I'm about to check this mark. No disrespect to Question Mark, but all I need is one shot to rip your chest apart. He's so sensitive about his height when direct asked him what it was for the grind time stacks, this faggot requested to leave a question mark. Oh. Hey yo, hey that's fucked up. That's yeah. that the you really of the, in this that video. battle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's amazing. And like also, you know, like Diz yelling so loud, I'm a, like as an audience member, I can only assume like how you're you're immediately like this guy's killing this little guy. Yeah. Like yeah. if you're not like really privy because Diz is so fucking loud and he's so aggressive and and like Greg uh Ilmax like even though it's like all clean, like he's not as quite as loud as Diz. Mm -hmm. So I could see like even in the back, you'd be like, dude, he just is murdering this little fool right now. Hey, yo, you want to talk about shit that's factual? You fucking amateur. What's factual is you tell me on the phone. I don't want it to be judged on or off of the camera. Oh. Dude, I never noticed how fucking fire what the that fuck? is. That's fucking really fire. He like rebuttaled that with the factual shit. At his height, when direct asked him what it was for the grind time stacks, this faggot requested to leave a question mark. Oh. Hey yo, hey yo, you want to talk about shit that's factual? You fucking amateur. What's factual is you tell me on the phone. I don't want it to be judged on or off of the camera. Oh. Yo, 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 yo. Hey, yo, yo, yo. <laughs> yeah, the spotlight for long enough. Now it's time to interfere. And losing to disaster gonna be the highlight of your career. And please, everybody, don't start calling this guy a queer because it might hurt his pride and he might decide to disappear and go back into hiding for a year. Oh. Oh. Fucking faggot time. <laughs> Love yes, it. grind time, man. Love it. Fucking grind time. That was a fire fucking round, man. Diz's ability to like uh, grab just fucking his random writtens and then put freestyles. Yeah, he in was there. doing that back then. Yeah, crazy. Even the fact that he did, he the way he writes too and prepares for battles is seriously like. I mean, I don't understand how your mind works like that. Yeah. Just how it's it, not just like him and Hollow. Yeah, him and Hollow and Sharon. Sharon yeah. also Iron can do that too. Iron told me the way he remembers. Uh, his stuff isn't like lines. He just remembers the joint connectors, so he can like insert stuff between. And as all, if he, as long as he realizes what those are, he can go back into his stuff, yeah. which is so fucking nuts. It's really only the vets. You notice that, like, yeah. it's the veterans that can can do that stuff. And, yeah. and it's weird, and it's probably because the years of practice growing up doing it in battles like this, yep. where they're willing to take that risk these days. If you're an upcoming rapper, you almost don't want to take that risk because you can't afford that you you yep. need to be on this steady climb the whole time right yep. so that's hella true it always impressed me t kid twist they because he was really good at like throwing in a rebuttal at the yeah. end of the round and, they, and he said he would have one line in a round that he would be willing to sacrifice if he thought of a rebuttal he'd ditch the throwaway line and insert a rebuttal i'm like that's, that's fucking crazy nuts. Kid that's twist is super insane himself, though. yeah yeah for sure he's always had uh flips and freestyles that i i was like he had to have write that. Yeah. It just sounds too, like, good, but... Twist was one of those people that, like, if you weren't prepared for him, he was prepared for you. Yeah. You know what I mean? How he many times do you battle him? Three or four. What's yeah. the record? Well, a couple of them were in the World Rap Championships, you know what I mean? Um, we battled at a Proud to Be a Battle MC, and I wasn't even supposed to battle that night. I was a fucking host, man, and then some kid didn't show up, and I got talked into it. Oh, shit. And then, of course, Kid yeah. Twist shows up and fucking all these other people. But um, yeah. me and Kid Twist were in the finals. They actually named me the winner, but it's so funny because when you go back and watch it, like, he clearly beat me. Oh, really? You know, but it's it's one of those things, like, 
when you had a freestyle battle, being able to see people like conceptualize and, and come up with the freestyles on the spot, like I think that's what people were going for. With Kid Twist, you could kind of tell his stuff was pre thought of. Yeah. And back then, that was like, oh, he's written. Yeah. You yeah. Know what I mean, it was like foreign. You didn't want to do yeah. that. But now that the times have changed, it's like, I wouldn't want to watch that on watch right now. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? For sure. Like, Definitely. Yeah. That's a good point. He was smart. He came prepared. 100%. You know? And that, again, I look at back like, I should have been prepared. I knew yeah. one day I was going to have to face Kid Twist, but my stupid ass was always like, yeah, I'll worry about that when I get there. You yeah. know what I mean? And then it happened in a competition I wasn't supposed to be at, and I had nothing for nobody. <laughs> and now <laughs> Kid Twist is walking the red carpet for his writing. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, <laughs> that's that was so amazing. taboo back then. Let's go. Now Let's go. <clears throat> Look. I know this battle seems major because I'm well known, but disaster, I'm appalled. I heard he had me as the screensaver on his cell phone. That's when I stopped answering his calls. And that's true. Look, I should have seen it coming. He got a big. I think that it was true. It is true. I he, remember. Okay, I'm sorry. Diz. I don't know I'm why. I'm going to throw you under the bus like in this that. one, but Diz God. had a fucking screen, uh, like a screen uh, that was comparing Ilmac to what kind of animals he looked like to like pr prep him for the battle. Be like, I can call him a chinchilla or like something that's else. That's kind of smart though. Like you got. No, it is you hella get, like, smart. People yeah. will be like, oh, it's crazy, but like that's dedication to like what you've signed up for. I if, agree. If every time you're gonna look at something and you want a reminder, like. You can't relax. Yep, yeah. Everything. Yep. We're all addicted to, to these. You know yep. what I mean? So it's, wow, so crazy. Disaster took me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, like, you know what I mean? It's just yeah. one of those things, like, it's that constant reminder of, like, don't forget. Yeah. This is coming yeah. up. Like, I kind of. That's, that's the thing, smart. though. Back, <laughs> if back then, finds out, that's it's a, like, it was, like, cool to fucking be like, I'm not taking this t serious. Yeah. Oh, you're taking this serious? That's whack. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Where it's like. Not really. Like, you signed yeah. up for this, and if you're taking this shit serious, you want to win. You know, it's yeah. the same thing as, like, getting in shape for, like, a fucking tournament or something. Or, like, you know, like, Ilmac often says, like, every opponent, he'll read a book, and that's to stay, keep his mind sharp, you know? If you're, like, doing something like that, I think that's, like, hella smart. It's not fucking I weird. don't doubt that. He's, the kid is ridiculously smart, man. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, Ilmac for real. Ridiculously smart. The answer in his calls, and that's true. Look, I should have seen it coming. He got a big bravado. Dude is tougher when he raps, but he was wouldn't swing on nothing. Shit, he wouldn't hit the lotto if he knew the numbers in advance. Dog, you ain't fucking with the champ. You must be dumber than you act. I can see him getting drunk up in the back slurring because I served him having a discussion with the plant like, son, it was a trap. <laughs> come on, come on, Lex. You thought they fill him in the projects? Don't act like a killer because you're not yet. Spitting all that filler in his nonsense. Try to fool them, but I'm familiar with the process. Oh, wow. You ain't winning oh, this one so off the air. Yeah. Fucking good. That's so hard to this day was Holy fucking amazing, shit. dude. Son, it was a trap. <laughs> come on, come on, Lex. You thought they fill him in the projects? Don't act like a killer because you're not yet. Spitting all that filler in his nonsense. Try to fool them, but I'm familiar with the process. Dog, you ain't winning this one off the underdog effect, but something must have upped his confidence because his one accomplishment is being that guy that the source was fucking robbed against. <laughs> I don't need a blade to cut him. This suburban thug's counterfeit. Now someone tell Mozzie to save his cousin before I make a fucking Persian rug out of him. Check it out. It's to prove to y'all that this is freestyle, right? But okay, yeah, that's pretty cool, dog. Just kill the hype. The Saurus got robbed in the battle. Hmm, doesn't that remind y'all of spin the mic? Yo, check it out. Hey, yo. He reached, crazy, his, he reached yeah. his head. Yeah, he went over Ilmac's head. I remember that. And I remember when he did that, he got hella close to him, too. I was like, whoa, you almost he, like, he kicked him. He got hella close to Dom when he did it, too. Yeah, I know. I know. Head. I always thought about that, like, with the, the spin kick. I'm like, what if you actually kick him, dude? Yeah. <laughs> Every 10 years, he kicks. So he tries to kick him. <laughs> or, but yeah, man. All these kicks he's thrown in about him, but he's landed a punch. <laughs> <laughs> um, dude, that, uh, that rebuttal and then... With that, too, that a rebuttal of that magnitude where he's, like, physically doing something is fucking crazy. Ajax just don't move, bro. You can have the best line. He just, everyone would just jump around. Yeah, he just, just, uh, and even his boy. It's yeah. okay. Excise <laughs> bugging out in the back. Let's run the back. The source got robbed in the battle. Hmm, doesn't that remind y'all of spin the mic? Yo, check it out. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. 
bitch, if I fight you, then you're dead. You little faggot, I can probably kick higher than your head. Hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, I dare you, hey, yo. You mean to tell me that this is the guy holding the torch? Trying to say that my multis are forced when you're the size of a primordial dwarf. Dude, and like you can see after he like did that uh, kick, he's just like, the audience is behind him and he's just like, yeah. he's like, ho like a predator, like fucking but honing in. That's what I mean when I say like, when Diz is like that, he's almost unbeatable. Yeah, Once he zones sure. in and he has this fucking like electromagnetic force yeah. that he's like, <laughs> For real, somehow dog. brought into For like real, this energy, bro. it's like, what yeah. do you do to counter he's that? He's literally man? invincible you know? at that point. For sure. I remember just like when I bat on him, it's like he'd have that, and then I'd rap, and it just sounded like, yo. Yeah. <laughs> you, yeah. You, for sound, real. you feel so fucking weak after yeah. your voice. It just is like, ah. Yep. Oh, hey, yo, I dare you. Hey, yo. You mean to tell me that this is the guy holding the torch? Trying to say that my multis are forced when you're the size of a primordial dwarf. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. And since there's no more WRC, your legacy's been falsified. Either shortness is hereditary from your father's side, or you're just a chinchilla that's genetically modified. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. You're a rapper without soul, so shut the fuck up and go back in your mouse hole and continue working for Santa at the South Pole. <laughs> Fucking faggot, bitch, I'll smack this snitch. Smack <laughs> this bitch. Oh, yeah, I love this part. <laughs> so shut the fuck up and go back in your mouth hole and continue working for Santa at the South Pole. Oh. Fucking faggot, bitch, I'll smack this snitch. Snatch her bitch and toss her fucking and serve her the woolly mammoth stick and liver covered in camel shit. <laughs> Stab her in her ass and tits. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that might be, I didn't even know that battle ended like that. That might be my new favorite <laughs> way to end a battle. I'll stab her in her ass and tits. 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 time. Hell yeah. Oh my god, man. Fucking, Classic, uh, bro. and then, so the really interesting thing about this battle, and this is why I think Ilmac is fucking such an asshole, but also really smart. So the battle's four rounds. First three is 60 seconds, the last one's 90. But the, tr the, the little uh, twist is, whoever goes first... The third round, they have to go again for the fourth. So yeah. it's like back to back. Yeah. So his it's thinking like of that of is that you're going to fucking gas out. Yeah. Like whoever does that, you're going to gas out. So he, at the beginning of the battle, volunteers That's to so go That's so strategic. Yeah. So Diz will gas out. Because what he, he told me is that when he was b battling Thesaurus, he saw that he got on this like multi riddling off thing where he's like fucking invincible and people are just like oh my god it's so much information but he loses track and he loses focus and kind of like gets gassed so that was his plan to fucking like purposely gas his out 90 second rounds 90 second rounds this is 90 second round. round. the fourth round right here this is number four cause that's a real W it's four fingers you feel me okay okay that's cool hey y'all <laughs> well, see, when you partnered up with the source, we thought you would move up quicker. But being around him, all that proof is that you use too much filler. See, Ooh. I knew this one-on-one -on -one format for you would never pass. Because without Peter, you're pathetic trash. So I guess this is living proof that Everlast could never last without his better hat. <laughs> <laughs> yes, let's go. Hey, yo. Tis becoming a fucking velociraptor mid-round is amazing. Because without Peter, you're pathetic trash. So I guess this is living proof that Everlast could never last without his better hat. <laughs> How the fuck are you gonna even battle me? You are part of an online rap group called Whack MCs, and for you YouTube faggots that don't understand it. Shout out Whack MCs, yeah, huh? Man, that was again, again. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's funny. Me and Elmac talk about that, man. Like we were actually in a rap group when we were like. 14, 15 with each other. We didn't even know who each other were. It was like all this like online stuff. We just knew who the good people were. So we like formed this group. And before SoundCloud, it was SoundClick. And we were like so big on fucking SoundClick. So so many people found out about us because we would just like record freestyles and throw it up. But yeah. we were so ahead of our time back then that people were like mesmerized by it. Like, yeah. you know, and they debate like, oh, they wrote this. It's like, it was crazy, man, but yeah, shout out to Wack MC. Shout out Pistol Tongue. Yeah. Just do your research and holler back at me, then you actually see what disaster speaks is reality. Hey, yo, wow. you never sold half as much as Mac Lethal. How you gonna diss me when uh, I'm Arab and you're part of a group called Sand People? Hey, yo, <laughs> hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo. Hey, yo. Capitalized off 
feel like a true star. But winning well for you never took you too far. Wonder why the sore souls outshines you because he's more humble than you are. And after this battle, he's going to walk up to you and be like, it's OK, we both got crushed by Kumar. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Yo, yo. Punchlines, I don't even need to spit. Let's talk about how you took your first chance to get some cream and chips. Switched on your team and split. Left the sound gods and hopped on the sand people's dick and ditched your homies like a low-life piece of shit. Oh. Yeah, me too. The way he, yeah. right, too, the way yeah. he performed that and just a low-life yep. piece of shit. Yep, and, everything about it. And too. that comes back in the Swords vs. Ilmac when he says, I'm... You, you'll be mad when you found out I told Disaster what a low-life piece of shit oh, you are. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Good call, man. Yo, hey, yo, yo, yo. Punchlines, I don't even need to spit. Let's talk about how you took your first chance to get some cream and chips. Switched on your team and split. Left the sound gods and hopped on the sand people's dick and ditched your homies like a low-life piece of shit. Oh. 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 So you need to vacate. What happened to working and making albums with Lost Spoken, Anonymous, Dane, and Stalemate? Hey yo, hey yo, damn fucking whack homie had his homies left on the curb. Now I gotta shout him out in the rest of my verse so they get the proper respect they deserve. That's crazy. Oh, That's fucking crazy. That's what I spoke and using whack MCs too. Oh yeah, oh, yeah dude. <laughs> Did okay. he just kill a roach? No, no, no. no. He stomps a water bottle. Watch, like there's this water bottle. He stomps it and there's a fan near it. They go like, they like get scared. They start. <laughs> Dude, the, the kid in the white shirt. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's so mad. Yeah. 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 Oh. <laughs> That's so crazy. He calls him. <laughs> this is also amazing. Uh, he goes, wait, wait, was that the fourth round? Because he's probably so high in adrenaline. And Flex goes, yeah, you just rapped, asshole. <laughs> Come on! Hey, yo! Shut the fuck up! Is that the fourth round? Yes. yes. You just rap for 90 seconds, asshole. <laughs> hey, can't send people, bitch. I knew you'd want to try and mention it. See, homie's the class clown with bottled inside resentment, thinking because of his cultural background, he's most qualified for membership. Oh. Dog. Yo, I'll admit it, he's got jokes, but he should focus on getting a job because he lives with his mom broke. Spending his time building ships in a bottle, trying to be a fucking adult cinema aficionado. <laughs> Look, I like getting ass from naked chicks after I even have him make me grits. Maybe some chicken and waffles. Ask him why he from naked chicks. chicks. He likes porn. I like getting ass from naked chicks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to be a fucking adult cinema aficionado. <laughs> Look, I like getting ass from naked chicks after I even have them make me grits. Maybe some chicken and waffles. Ask him why he hasn't laid a chick. You'll probably hear the faggot say some shit like I've never been in a brothel. Well, I don't care about your past relationships. You can get amped wave like this, but your writings are awful. I can't stand the way you spit because you're an animated bitch like Mrs. Krabappel. <laughs> It is still the yeah. so like when that happened, I was like, bro, oh, animated bitch, like Mrs. Krabappel. Yeah. Just like the whole build up for it. Yeah. yeah. All right, Mrs. Krabappel. Yeah. Fucking amazing. Oh, yeah. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Yo. Instead of bitching or trying to forget this tomorrow, use it as ammunition once you've written your novel. Like, I took a loss to Omac, and I just wanted to rap in the same division as Hollow. Duh, you should have known better. You were no threat to me. That's why it came so prep for me. I ain't think I had any known enemies till I seen Wonder Woman with the Hulk energy. Yo, hold on. That's why he yells and screams. He enhanced his flow chemically and took it as a go-ahead to smoke meth when I said being a cokehead is so 70s. Look, he wanted to be a rapper, thought he knew the whole recipe, traded in his Warren Burka for something more urban. Now he's feeling so fresh and clean. He got his pop spinning cheese on his fitted seat. Now he's in the zone mentally. Cop some bigger tees, but you're not a G. Authenticity sold separately. <laughs> I love how Ilmac builds up the punches. I think, like, um... Even even the other one, the the whole Krabappel, it's not like yeah. just the way he kind of builds it up. It's not always like what he says. It's almost like the the um, the energy. You just feel it kind of like peaking, 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 boom. You know yep. what I mean? It's like it, it builds up to it. You're waiting, you're waiting, you're waiting, and then it hits. Yeah. You know what I mean? Totally agree. 
Yeah, that's think, a fucking uh, fire ass battle, yeah, man. Yeah, really yeah. good battle on both sides too, yeah. man. Like I yeah. forgot how good that was. Really yeah. good battle. I remember when it dropped, there was like definitely like everybody was like Diz washed Ilmac, and then everybody yeah. was like, man, mm-hmm. Ilmac came back and got washed twice in the same day because he did lose to Madness. But I think this battle has aged finer in Ilmac's favor. Yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, man, like both fucking came with some amazing shit. There's some awesome moments on there that like definitely like capture the nostalgia of that era of like the quick freestyling on the on the spot and just like man that that venue too like i can't tell you the energy that was in the venue for a lot of the battles you felt it when you're at yeah. battle b5 it's just like fuck man miss and, that shit and that's what i mean like um those that room was huge too yeah. So, like, now you put that many people in a room that big and the atmosphere is dead. Yeah. It's not the same anymore. Like, the people were just so fucking excited to hear someone get made fun of. Yeah, for real. <clears throat> Dope-ass battle. 